Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is a weekly love and general situationship tarot reading session for you Cancer. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. Okay. This reading for today, it is for the Cancer sign. Thank you so much Cancer for coming back. Thank you so much for uh, being here. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button and the bell, please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, Cancer, you know what to do. All of the details, it's down in the description box below, okay? So this is for you. Let's see what's coming towards you this week. What is the message for you? In today's reading, we will be looking at the past, the current energy, and the immediate future predictive outcome and advice. And depending on the message for today, I will let you know if there's a need to extend the reading. This is for Cancer. Let's see what's coming to us in love, relationship, dating, getting to know, career, finance, and general situationship. Okay. So you started off with the Five of Swords in upright position. You've got the Ace of Cups in reverse, and you've got a Three of Wands in reverse. Okay. Um, I feel like someone is not over you. Okay. There was an offer, okay? Um, there was an offer in the past. Um, I felt like it didn't push through or something happened that you had a disagreement or misunderstanding while the offer is in process. It could be an offer of love because this is an Ace of Cups. It could be an offer of um, a job offer. It could be um, something that you're going to support them. They're going to support you. It's something of an understanding, okay? You you guys have some sort of understanding. It was going well, but something happened that could be one of you postponed or stopped the processing of the support, love, attention, because this is emotional. It, you know, Ace of Cups represent um, emotional. Um, it seems to be things between you and the things uh, you know the things involved in the processing of this offer it's suspended three of wands seems to be you're quite lost on where you and this person like you're quite lost where you're quite lost on on when it's gonna pick up again or some sort of when it's the update something to do with you're still keen you know one of you is still keen at least maybe two of you five of swords because you know the five of swords this is a behind you know a behind the back door so one of you is still at least one of you or it could be you it could be them but at least one of you is still interested to find out whether this could proceed or whether things would still work out okay i feel like for some of you guys you're not talking to this person or i feel like if if this is a romantic situation you're one of you is acting lay low or stepping back or cold shoulder. For some of you, if it's a personal relationship, uh, there's some sort of two-face or pretending energy around the two of you that's actually you guys are connected, but you guys are not really talking with the very important details that needs some sort of closure or that needs to be continued. You know, someone is you know, playing a bit of Cupid in here, a bit of mind game, okay? Let's clarify the Five of Swords. Yeah, Eight of Cups. I mean, Eight of Cups, this is one thing to talk again. You know, Eight of Cups is a return. You know, Eight of Cups, this is like, I want to talk about the same issue, the same problem because I want to proceed. So something tells me that someone is, someone in here is pretending to be okay with how things are right now. But actually, in essence, in reality, that's not what they want. You've got the Knight of Swords in here, yeah. Someone would like to take back things the way it was before. They wish they have not said things, or they wish they wouldn't. They did not agree. Something tells me that they wish to take it back. They wish to go back in time and take it back, you know, and rewind so that they can take it back and go back in that same day, same time they said no, or you had an argument or misunderstanding. The Three of Wands in reverse, yeah. There's so much love, you know. Um, one of you at least, or it could be it could be them. King of Cups, the three of wands clarified by the King of Cups. There's so much love, you know. Uh, someone could not move on or forget about this Ace of Cups because there's still love. There's so much to want for things to continue. 
between you and your person or an offer or it could be a project that someone would like to belong would like to continue would like to go on but you guys are not admitting that you both want the same thing yeah exactly um this is your current energy um I feel like you are waiting for the person or for the situation to fall through, you know. I feel like the Knight of Pentacles is seen here. Yeah, King of Wands. I feel like you're waiting and wanting it. You want it and you're waiting. Wanting it and waiting. Wanting and waiting at the same time, um, Cancer. But the King of Wands in the reverse, um, I'm really getting like, if you want it, why not take it? There's... There's, a, there's an energy coming from you where you're not moving but waiting. You know, something tells me that you want it but you're not moving. Because the Knight of Pentacles this is a very slow moving night. It is so slow that it, lo it looks like it's not moving. So something tells me that you want it but you're, you're, you want it. You're, you want it, you're waiting for it but you're not moving towards it. King of Wands, you're not putting an energy to move faster or to grab the opportunity in here cancer five of pentacles the mutual energy between you and your person is the five of pentacles let's look at the five of pentacles in here let's clarify the five of pentacles the magician card oh okay the high priestess um this is abandonment okay when this is in reverse this is abandonment but it sorry when this is an upright position this is abandonment but it's just, it's in reverse so clarified when I clarify the, by the the five of pentacles, it's supported by the magician card and the high priestess. Um, I feel like you're waiting and wanting at the same time. It's actually going to pay off because you've got the magician card. It means that as you wait, you're also at well. If you know, sometimes if we wait and if we want it, and sometimes you know, wanting and waiting could put the vibration up. You know, it's like tapping into wanting it and waiting it and somehow it has click. You know, it has, you have raised the vibration to the universe, you know. And it seems to be the magician card, the high priestess, your manifestation. Because this is the mutual energy. This is the mutual energy. This is the mutual energy between you and your person. So you're waiting and wanting at the same time has resulted into a manifestation. Um, it seems to be you're so close to that waiting and wanting. You're so close to whatever you want. It could be love because this is two of cups. It could be an offer. It could be attention from a male person. But your manifestation is getting stronger. So that waiting and wanting at the same time, it's getting stronger. Magician card and high priestess. And I feel like you're waiting and wanting. It's not just a small percentage. You want it all what you want is big or it could be for some of you you're wanting this but the universe is going to give you more than what you deserve more than what you want magician card the high priestess something in the background tells me that you're going to get more than what you want what you ever expected for um you got the magician card the high priestess okay now the external energy like, this is the person that you want the two of cups this is the situation that you want to be connected this is the this is you know this is the external energy they have the two of cups so in the immediate future i feel like this person ten of wands two of cups from now two of cups well firstly this person would like to take its time a little bit but they're coming toward with a two of cups of they don't want to miss the opportunity this is the hidden energy two of cups this is i want to be in agreement with you like this person before they could really start all over again with you they want to be in agreement with you i feel like this could be a negotiation or a compromise or it could be a message where it's gonna stand out yeah i'm really getting like a word that be, I'm, ge I'm 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 getting like an energy that okay before we proceed we continue to this what we left off you know um this was this is possibly the reason why you're not moving towards what you want because you know that what you want wants you and it's moving towards you before it makes a move this person cancer before this person or this situation makes a move it would have to confirm to you that it's also what you want because i feel like it's what you want you know the knight of pentacles the person that you want 
the offer, the project, the situation that you want. They want you as well. But before they can proceed, you know, hidden energy, before they can proceed with the Ace of Pentacles, they want to make sure that you will accept the cup. Okay? So something tells me, if you want it, you've got to give a little. You know, if you want something, you have to give an indicator or a sign or a hope to the other person that, hey, I want it. Because playing, you know, staying to playing, staying, you know, like doing so much playing Cupid or mind game, it would wash off the interest because you've got good cards in here like something tells me in the next two weeks there is a divine timing at play where what you actually want wants you like you're so close getting what you want you know two of cups magician card i felt like there's so much availability happening coming from your person where the main goal is a two of cups yeah something tells me your person your situation in the in the immediate future ten of wands they will push through they will do everything for you to agree. You might say no. I'm getting a red flag with the two of swords that you might play Cupid. You might say no. Or maybe you might delay answering them. If you play a little bit of Cupid, if you delay answering yes, because I feel like you still want the offer or you still want the person, it would just prolong the process. It might prolong the process because right now, your person is sitting in the two of cups yeah oh my god cancer your person wants it all okay your person wants it all they will proceed they will they they will they will work hard to make things happen for you and them whatever this is they will work collaboratively with you but they need to know if you are in this with them you know they need to feel or to hear or to see from you that you're interested I'm seeing here the two of swords. You might hesitate. I'm getting this from you, from your energy. If you hesitate, which, you know, you have your reason. If you hesitate or if you delay or hesitate or you slow down in terms of giving them an answer or communicating with them, whether you're playing hard to get or whether you just really want to take things slow, they will still pursue you, ten of wands. But if you stay too long in the mind, the mind game, this person might mirror you. Yeah, nine of wands. Because they're willing to do everything to make it work between the two of you. But if they sense that it's too much of waiting or a bit of mind mind game or maybe playing hard to get Cupid, nine of wands, they will be very defensive and they it will warn them out. And they might withdraw completely with the proposal, the situation, uh, the romantic offer. Whatever it is that you're focused in the next two weeks. So someone is really keen to make it work. But they need an energetic yes from you. They need your yes. They need your answer. Like an absolute answer. No no indecisiveness. Someone needs your answer, cancer. You being decisive because they're all... Like they're, someone is all out for you to make it happen. There's a lot of tens in here. And two of cups. Ten of pentacles. I mean... This is something that would move. Just say yes. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. So this is what I've got for you, Cancer. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for tuning in. It's a pleasure doing the reading to you guys. I will see you very soon. You have a great day. Bye-bye.